A wise country songwriter once said, it's just a Bud Light, but ain't it funny what one beer can turn into. I'd love to say it was love at first sight for me, but as two of our best friends who are sitting here today know, the champagnes, it wasn't. What you been doing? What you gonna say? How you gonna feel at the end of the day? Do you ever wonder if it ever gets old? Does all that get up leave you shining black like gold? In our case, it was a few more than one beer right off the bat because I was double fisting my beverages, as most newly single 24-year-olds do. But in regards to what our first beer turned into, well, it has turned into my favorite love story, one that is beyond my wildest dreams and prayers. I can't wait to call you my wife and to tear it up on the dance floor alongside our family and friends as we celebrate heading into this next chapter. All right, so we're gathered here today to celebrate the love and commitment between Andrew and Kate. And as their officiant, it's an honor and a privilege to stand before you and witness their lives joining in marriage. But today, let's not take ourselves too seriously because if there's one thing these two have taught me, and probably all of you, is that life is meant to be enjoyed, cherished, and filled with laughter. Every show can speak and we can hear the and then one day, uh, I get a call from him saying that he was going to visit our buddy and fellow groomsman Kyle in New York City. And at first, I was a little upset that I didn't get the invite for the boys' trip. Uh, however, I quickly realized this was not a boys' trip at all. I think, uh, what, Kyle, you spent 15 minutes with you that weekend? Uh, but the rest of the time, he hung out with this girl uh, named Kate. And Drew mentioned he was bringing this girl he was dating. After a few minutes of chatting, I'm Builder Sister, slash grilling Kate. We were going in a little bit. I thought to myself, wow, she's intelligent, she's fun, attractive. She's very bold. Kate and I share a birthday, for those who don't know, and the fact that she admitted it on day one was astonishing to me. But I thought, literally thought to myself, I should tell her to run. This is, I know my brother and I've known him for years. She should get the hell out of Dodge here. But amidst all the laughter and fun, there's something truly special about the way Caitlin and Andrew support and uplift each other. They're more than just your typical couple. They're partners in crime, companions for life, and a true team. You two lift each other up. You're a dynamic duo. Whether it's experimenting with new recipes with Chef Drew or cheering each other on from the sidelines of your individual pursuits, Together, you're a constant source of encouragement, reminding us all that together, we can accomplish anything. Drew, during the time of my life that I met you, I wasn't even looking for love, yet you ended up being exactly what my heart was searching for. I promise to do my best when it comes to remembering would I rather be right or would I rather be happy. With you, I choose happy every single day. These past five and a half years with you have been the best years of my life, and I am beyond, beyond excited to see what our future holds. From our early days of long distance between Davenport and New York City to Chicago and now in our new home of Charleston, South Carolina. Life with you has been the greatest adventure I could ever ask for. Though, for the record, with everyone else here, I do choose right. <laughs> this is where it begins.
matter if it ends 